God is our strength and refuge, a helper ever near. While resting in His shelter, no evil will we fear. Brothers and sisters in the Lord, we welcome you to the first Sunday in the month of July, which is the fourth day and the first meditation in the new month. It is our prayer for you and your entire household that disasters will be far away from you. There is no denial of the fact that everywhere we turn to today in our country, the only news we hear is about kidnapping, banditry, herdsmen brutality, burning of houses, burning of properties, burning of police stations, and other assets belonging to individuals corporate bodies, or evil government. Indeed, this is a very trying time in the life of our nation. But then, it is also at a time like this also, brothers and sisters, we want to bring the message of hope to you that God is still in the business of securing his people as confidently echoed by the psalmist in Psalm 46 and verse 1. God is a refuge and strength a very present help in trouble. So in our meditation ahead, in the next four Sundays by the grace of God, and for the whole of this month of July, we shall be looking at the promises of God to us from Psalm 46. And so today, we shall be looking at the opening verse, which says, God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. At a time like this, where the security architecture of Nigeria as a nation seems to have collapsed or lost its bearing. And the government is overwhelmed by the crisis of insecurity. Where do we turn to, brothers and sisters? Practically, there is palpable fear everywhere. To travel on a highway these days has become a matter of great concern. Yes, and indeed, there is fear all over our land. But then, Walking in the faith of the Son of God, who loved us and gave himself unto us, we can confidently say, yes. Like the psalmist says, though we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. The reason we can say without any hesitation is that God is our refuge and strength, a very present help in trouble. So, as you go on in this week, we speak prophetically into your life, brothers and sisters, and all those who are connected to you, that none of you will be a casualty. The arrows of the herdsmen, the arrows of the bandits, or the kidnappers in their cunning ways, the arrows will not cut your life short. God will be your refuge in times of fears, in times of danger. It doesn't matter wherever you travel. The Lord of hosts will provide means of escape for you. Brothers and sisters, as you go on in every of the seven days in this new week, we declare confidently that on every side, God will be your refuge and your strength. It will be a present help you require at every point in time. Have a blessed week, and the presence of the Lord will go ahead of you, and all shall be well with you in the name of Jesus.